We're over here at Fuma Dubai. This is Beaumont's newest hookah and lounge. They also have lunch. So that's what we're gonna check out today. See what kind of food they have here over at Fuma Dubai. I'm interested to know about it. I don't know too much about it, but we're gonna find out all about it inside. Let's go. Hi, my name is Zevi. I'm the general manager of Fuma Dubai. So this is Fuma Dubai. Our concept is mixology and hookah and we try to put them together so the city of Beaumont can see something new. Because whenever you go to a hookah place, you don't have a really good variety on the mixed drinks. So we try to mix the mixology along with hookah and it came up with the idea of Fuma Dubai. We're looking to be a high-end place with a little bit of Mediterranean food and also American food, pretty much like snacks. We had like smash burgers, we got the lamb chops, we got kebabs as well, shawarma plates. We, we got a small variety of um, items that people can uh, order and enjoy. The most unique item we have here, I'll say is the smash burger. That's the item we sell. We've been selling the most, people sucking about it. So we're really proud of the smash burger. I think we have done a really good job on that. They can find us on 4438 Downing Road, Street 101, next to Tokyo. And if they want to find us online, they can search us on Fuma Dubai Hookah Lounge on Facebook and also on Instagram as well. And we soon, we're gonna be opening a TikTok account where we're gonna uh, show all of our drinks and all the atmospheres that we live here every night. All right guys, so made it here to the back of the kitchen. They're cooking up my food. Today I'm gonna have the mixed grill, the smash burger, uh, the kibe, and some other things. I, I'm not sure what all, but I'm sure I'll be presenting it at the table. I'm excited to uh, eat it. Rafael right here. He's the one cooking up all my food and uh, I'm excited to eat it. It looks real good, it smells real good. So I'm excited to get my hands on it. All right guys, so I just talked to uh, David over there, the general manager of Fuma Dubai, and he was telling me about their food. Fuma Dubai, they have a mix of different types of cuisine. They have American, they have Mexican, and they also have Mediterranean. So if you guys like Mediterranean food, like falafels or gyros, they have that. They also have Philly cheesesteaks and fajitas. So there's something for everybody here at Fuma Dubai and uh, I'm excited to uh, taste it. Right now they're cooking it up over there and uh, I'm prepared to get my eat on. All right guys, so this is some of the appetizers right here. This is the kibe right here. So let's go ahead and uh, try this one first. We have other two things over here. This is basically We'll tell you that about that in a little bit, but let's put some of the uh, lemon inside here. There we go. This is like a yogurt. Yogurt, I'm pretty sure it has some cucumber in there too. So let's try this. This is like kibe, has some meat. I am very hungry, so my mouth is watering. Mm. It's like a fried meatball good especially with the uh, yogurt and the lemon it's a good little appetizer for sure I got some Mediterranean flavors in there can't really tell can't really decipher what it is but inside of it good stuff got some ground beef for sure good little protein ball right here fried protein ball alright guys this is the next thing we have we actually have two dishes so this is two versions of the same dish. This is the shawarma inside here, and this is like the shawarma bowl over here. So this is basically the chicken, like without it being wrapped. So it does have some uh, pita on the side and everything else. So let's go ahead and try this one. This is the shawarma. I used to get these in the, in the Philippines. I used to go to a grocery store. They used to have shawarmas all the time. That's one of my favorite things to get. They were super cheap in the Philippines, of course. Let's give this a taste. Looks like it already has the yogurt sauce inside of it, has the tomatoes and everything else. You see that? All right, let's give this a taste. Mm. That's good. Right away, the flavors punch you in a good way. Good little punch of flavor. That yogurt balances everything else out. So you gotta eat one big whole bite with the meat, the onions, the tomato, and the yogurt. 
super flavorful. It's good. It does need a little kick of something. I did see that they have some um, hot sauce back in the back. You know, I love hot sauce, so this could use that. But yeah, this is good. This, has, this is actually a mix of the chicken and the beef or lamb, I'm not sure. Let's try the bowl over here. So this is basically the bowl, not wrapped. You have it with the rice. So almost like that famous New York Halal's guy place. So let's just get a little bit of tomato, a little bit of the chicken, put that in the yogurt. The rice is good, nice and fluffy. Get the pita, get the chicken, some of the onions, some rice, and then dip it inside of the sauce. All right, let's give this a bite. This is the perfect bite right here. This is good too. I'm gonna try to tell you some of the flavors inside the chicken. Salt, for sure, pepper. That's all I can tell you. Other than that, it is very Mediterranean. I'm not the best at describing food, but I know what's good. I know what good food is, and this is very tasty. Especially the rice. I like the rice. Filipinos love rice. If you watched my last video over at the Filipino festival, they ran out of rice. So over here at Puma Dubai, they have all the rice you could want. So far, my favorite out of these three dishes is probably going to be the gyro right here. The gyro is this a nice easy sandwich to eat and again it reminds me of the philippines when i was eating shawarma over there in the philippines right now we're waiting for our other dishes gonna get something else this is gonna be more more dinner than this one this is this is a this is good this is a lot of food this bowl lots of food this one had two of these gyros in there you're gonna be stuffed either way you go all right guys i'm gonna give you a little tour of the place over here over here is like at nighttime they turn this to like a you know, lounge area. So this is like the VIP lounge area right here. They, they would uh, block it off for people. You have some more seating area over here. Right there, you have the nice bar over here. Nice and decorated, they have all the drinks you guys can want. A lot of different mixed drinks too. I'm not drinking today, but they have all the drinks that you could want. Not to mention they also have the outside patio. So this is the outside patio over here. You do hookah over here. You can watch the cars go by, the movie theater goers go by. Uh, pretty nice, yeah. Like for, for Beaumont, you don't see many places like where they actually decorate it up and make it look nice. Like look at this wall right here. This wall, this is like Instagrammable stuff. That's what I like to see at restaurants, Instagrammable stuff. Because, you know, social media, that's what it's all about. That's how you get people to come to your place. If you make it nice, people will come. And uh, that's why I'm here today. So let's see if I have more food inside. All right, check out this plate. This plate is the mixed platter, mixed grill platter. So we got some chicken, get some beef. We got some lamb right here. And this is also lamb chops over here too, over a bed of rice. And also a pita bread with garlic. And this one is like just regular yogurt. Plus, of course, I got my hot sauce over there. The other thing we got over here is their famous smash burger over here. So this is what uh, a lot of people come here for specifically is their smash burger. So uh, let's give the smash burger a try first. So this is the smash burger right here. You got the grilled onions, the cheese is all melted, two patties. And then the french fries, it's huge. Look how big that is, it's as big as my head. Let's give it a try. Mm. Oh good, you even have like a little special sauce. And pickles. Nice, beefy flavor. And the bread is good. This is like a potato, a potato roll. Can't go wrong with this. This is really good. This is tasty. One more bite. Good looking burger. All right, check out this meat platter right here. This is a feast of meats. So 
Let's uh, give it a try. Let's see. Let's try out this sauce thing. I think one of them is garlic, so let's try it. That one is the garlic sauce. Let's go ahead and try some of this kebab right here. I'm gonna try it with a little bit of the garlic and then a dab of the hot sauce. The chili sauce. That's good. With the rice. A little bit of the yogurt. Good stuff. Let's try the uh, beef right here. This is the beef. Dip in the garlic. Dip in a little bit of the chili sauce. Nice and tender. And they have the, some pita in the bottom too. So if I wanted to wrap it in there, you do that or you just dip it inside the garlic sauce to get that. This is the plot you should get if you want to experience everything that they have here. It has four different types of meats. I'm gonna save the lamb chop for last. We'll try a little bit of the chicken. I'm getting so full right now, so I have to uh, pace myself over here. So let's try the chicken right here. We'll try it by itself. He says that they marinate everything and you can tell. The meat's very flavorful. I'm kind of liking this. All right, last thing. This is the, the one I've been waiting for. Look at that, it's still smoking. Got a little bit of fat right there. This is the lamb chop right here. Let's taste it. Mm. Perfectly seasoned. Doesn't need any more salt. It's salted well, and the lamb flavor comes out. I think this is now my favorite. It used to be the kebab. Now this is my favorite thing, the lamb chop. This is, this is the best thing here. Let's put a little bit of the garlic and the chili. Come here, get this plate. The burger's good, but you have burgers everywhere. This is good, the burger's really good but I like this platter better. It's a little something different here in Beaumont that you don't get everywhere. So try the platter when you come over here. This is what I like. I'm gonna try to finish this food and I'll talk to y'all outside in the truck. All right guys, so that's it for Fuma Dubai. I enjoyed it, the food was good, especially those lamb chops. Those were definitely my favorite. That was something that I think y'all should get. The Smash Burger, if you guys want a Smash Burger, they have a legit one too. Uh, those are my two favorites for sure. Those two dishes at the end, they were my favorite. If you guys wanna check it out, make sure to check them out over here across from Parkdale Mall, right next to Tokyo. They have some good food over here. The new concept over here that they have, you know, pretty cool to have something like this here in Beaumont. And now Fumo Dubai is a spot for you guys to go. Make sure to check it out. And if you guys wanna follow me to the food, make sure to subscribe to me on YouTube. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, 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 oh,